Mountain biking is a thrilling and adventurous sport that can take you through some of the most beautiful and challenging terrain. Choosing the right bike is crucial to your success and enjoyment on the trails. One of the most significant decisions you will need to make is whether to go for a 26 or 29 inch wheel size. In this video, 26 versus 29 mountain bikes to help you make an informed decision. So grab a seat and let's dive in. Twenty-six and twenty-nine inch wheels are the two most common sizes for mountain bikes. Twenty-six inch wheels have been the standard for years, while twenty-nine inch wheels have gained popularity in recent years. A twenty-six inch mountain bike is generally more agile and maneuverable than a twenty-nine inch bike. It can be a better choice for technical trails, tight turns, and jumps. It may also be easier to control for smaller or lighter riders. A twenty-nine inch mountain bike on the other hand, is typically faster and more stable than a 26-inch bike. The larger wheel size allows it to roll over obstacles more easily, making it a good choice for cross-country and endurance riding. It may also be more comfortable to ride for taller or heavier riders. Each size has its own advantages and disadvantages, which we'll explore in detail. Wheel Size The most obvious difference between 26 and 29-inch mountain bikes is the wheel size. 26-inch wheels are smaller and lighter, making them more maneuverable and responsive. 29-inch wheels are larger and heavier, making them more stable and better at rolling over obstacles. Traction Another crucial factor to consider is traction. Larger wheels have a larger contact patch with the ground, which means they can provide better traction and grip. However, smaller wheels are better at maintaining traction in tight turns and technical sections of the trail. Suspension Suspension is another essential component of a mountain bike, and it's affected by wheel size. 29-inch wheels have a longer wheelbase, which means they can handle larger suspension travel. This makes them ideal for riders who want to tackle more challenging terrain. On the other hand, 26-inch wheels have a shorter wheelbase, making them better suited for cross-country riding. Speed Speed is another important consideration when it comes to mountain biking. 29-inch wheels are faster on flat and smooth terrain, thanks to their larger size and better rolling ability. However, they can be slower in tight turns and technical sections of the trail. 26-inch wheels, on the other hand, are more nimble and agile, making them better suited for technical riding. Personal Preference At the end of the day, the choice between a 26 or 29-inch mountain bike comes down to personal preference. If you're a beginner or prefer cross-country riding, a 26-inch bike may be the best choice for you. If you're an experienced rider looking to tackle more challenging terrain, a 29-inch bike may be a better option. Maintenance Another factor to consider is maintenance. Larger wheels require more maintenance, as they have more spokes and a larger surface area to maintain. Smaller wheels are easier to maintain and replace, as they have fewer spokes and a smaller surface area. Price Price is always a factor when it comes to buying a mountain bike. 29-inch bikes tend to be more expensive than 26-inch bikes due to their larger size and more advanced suspension. However, there are plenty of affordable options available for both wheel sizes. Choosing between a 26 or 29-inch mountain bike can be a challenging decision, but understanding the pros and cons of each size can help you make an informed choice. Whether you prefer the agility and responsiveness of a 26-inch bike or the stability and traction of a 29-inch bike, there's a mountain bike out there that's perfect for you. So, get out there and hit the trails, no matter what size wheels you have. We are almost wrapping up. These are the common differences between these two. Hope you like this video. Please comment, share, and subscribe to this channel for more videos.